a new note on positive psychology. Positive psychology in practice and politics. I was talking the other day with uh, someone, a new member of our happiness is a choice maker group, which is on Facebook. And if you're watching this and you're interested, you can join. Uh, it has a long name because all the others have been taken. A Facebook group uh, called Only Happiness uh, would have a few million people, but that's born way before uh, I thought of creating a positive psychology or happiness group. And then also the other, happiness is a choice or whatever you have with happiness uh, is gone. And besides, uh, uh, it's not really um, brimming with excitement, activity, someday maybe. And uh, returning, and I was talking with this uh, person who is into a lot of physical activity, runs the marathon, that's so impressive. Um, can ride a bike for, I don't know, 120 more, maybe, kilometers a day. So she can do amazing things. Um, two things, well, maybe three, I didn't get, I didn't see as really positive. One was a uh, liking for Putin, really. Two, um, an interest, an exaggerated interest in those doing the same thing. I mean, a lot of physical work, uh, going beyond boundaries. There's some names I, I forgot instantly uh, because I don't think that's so. I mean, it's yes, it's amazing, it, you, it's awesome. You, I, we can be in awe uh, knowing about these people, but then I think. They, they are a role model for physical activity and um, it's probably not so interesting to follow whatever they say I mean, in terms of philosophy, let's say, there are others. And I gave the example of Andre Pleshin. I would rather listen to, follow, read what he says. He is champion of the mind, the champion of the, 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 the of, of football, let's say, uh, yes, runs fast, has a, a, a good uh, kick, you know, but when he starts talking, I don't know, even if it's the best, Messi, whatever, and um, that's an example which can be used in other, in other, many other fields, I'm thinking actors in Hollywood, directors, Hollywood Stone, Sean Penn, wonderful in their work. But then when you look at their politics, when you see that they admire the likes of Castro, uh, Maduro, or the late Chavez, and they went to meet them, and that's, that's sick, man. <laughs> um, so that was one thing I, I didn't really agree with. And the last, which was supposed to be the subject of this note, but I, I, I've been derailed. I think, I mean, surely I passed the middle of the note and didn't touch on the subject, but now I will, for what it's worth in the remaining couple of minutes. Uh, politics. So let's not promise me, she says, not to talk again about politics when and if we meet and talk again. Okay, but, and I know, I know people feel sick about this, the politicians are corrupt. Here we are. I was mentioning in the note of yesterday or the one before yesterday we're actually uh, I, I was uh, saying we're actually uh, led by um, uh, mobsters by a group of organized crime um, uh, members uh, the, the good fellows uh, they're corrupt they've been indicted, they've been sentenced in some cases, and they march on. And their interest was and is to pass laws that will just take their colleagues out of jail, 
and keep them out of jail even if uh, as rules and laws stand some of them will definitely will definitely enter jail prison so ergo therefore one needs to be interested in politics because uh, you need to see what's going on you have to somehow to the best of your ability try and prevent these uh, um, wise guys in the acceptance uh, of the word used in uh, films like Goodfellas or um, Donnie Brasco and so on, Casino um, and um, so that's 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 really important plus uh, the original meaning of the world was to be interested w w in what happens in the arena and we all need to be otherwise it will all come falling down it will things will fall apart as is the title of the masterpiece by Chinua Achebe